Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We continue on uh, 6.3 part 2 with electric uh, electricity supply and wiring system in homes. Before that, we start with our intro first. Electricity supply and wiring system in home. So alternating current with a voltage of 240 volts is supplied to our home by the live wire. Okay, the current is written to the substation by the neutral wire. And there is two type of uh, electrical wiring system. Number one is single phase wiring. And number two is uh, three phase wiring. Single phase wiring, this type of wiring uh, is only suitable and stable enough for electrical energy usage not exceeding uh, 10 kilowatt or 50 amperes. So example uh, is ready, uh, residential area in the countryside. Okay, next one is three phase wiring. This three uh, electrical energy uh, wiring uh, is suitable for usage exceeding 10 kilowatt or 50 amperes. So this three phase wiring is more stable and more reliable. And for example, it's commer uh, commercial and industrial area. So the supply of electrical energy and home electrical wiring system. So this is a diagram. So you can see that. So uh, from the new so we have live wire and also neutral wire. Okay, so it will enter the main fuse on external wall of the house. So you can see that uh, we have external. So uh, in this um, main fuse also have electrical energy meter. Okay, so from there we will uh, the the wire will connect it to the main switch that uh, also connected with the circuit breaker. So this circuit breaker is important to make sure uh, if something happened with uh, the voltage is, is too big enters, so it will have a circuit breaker. And then from that, they will connect it to the fuse box. And from this fuse box, we'll divide it into, uh, we'll divide uh, two wires one for the lamp circuit and one is the, for the socket, power circuit. Okay, so let's see the component of electrical wiring system at the, at home and their function are shown in the following. So as I mentioned earlier, so the fuse box is to uh, protect a house circuit from damage caused by a large current or overloading. Now, uh, next one is the main switch. So the main switch, Control the amount of current which flows through the circuit into the house. And next one is circuit breaker. So the circuit breaker uh, is to break the circuit by springing out or tripping its switch when the current flowing through, through it exit its ratings. Okay, we have uh, next one is live wire. So carries current at a voltage of 240 volt from the local substation to home. So the neutral wire, the function is to return the current from home to substation. Okay, we have also earth wire. So connected appliance, uh, appliances directly to earth as a safety measures. And electric meter is used to record the amount of electrical energy that have been used. We move on to the three pin plugs. So the electrical, electrical appliances such as electrical irons, kit, kettles, fan connected to the power supply of the house through three pin plug. Okay, a three pin plugs have three pin. And each pin is connected to the following wire. Number one is live wire. So L, which is brown color. Neutral wire N, which is blue. And earth wire E, which is has stripe 
of green and yellow. Okay, this diagram shows three pin plugs. So we can see here. So the earth wire, live wire, brown color, connected to the uh, to, uh, fuse and then connected to the uh, pin. So the earth wire on the top have uh, green and yellow stripe and neutral wire have blue color okay connected on the side of the three pin plug the outer insulation and also we have cable grip okay other than three pin plugs we have also two pin plugs okay the electrical appliances such as radio hair dryer electric clock are connected to the home power supply by two pin plug. For two pin plug, we have live wire and also neutral wire are connected to the two pin plug. So the color code for the wiring color code uh, for electrical is very important to ensure safety of the appliance application of the electrical appliances. So that uh, that I mentioned earlier, so we have type of uh, wire, live, neutral and earth, uh, which is live brown color, neutral blue and also earth is yellow and green stripe. Okay, next one is safety component in home wiring system. So the lightning conductor is safety component attached to the highest peak of the building and uh, is connected to the directly to earth using thick iron rod so when there is heavy rain with lightning so the lightning will strike at the lightning conductors on the building and electric current will flow through the iron rod that is connected to earth flow of the current uh, occur without any damage to the building this is an example of picture of uh, lightning strike to the building and this one is a diagram show the causing the lightning to strike. Okay, now we move on to the function of fuse and earth wire. Okay, number one is type of fuse. We have uh, two types. Number one is catrice fuse and number two is uh, replaceable fuse. So the rating of the fuse uh, is the value of the maximum current that is allowed to flow through the fuse without causing any fuse to uh, to melt. Okay, some common rating of fuse are one A, two A, three A, five A, ten A, and thirteen A. Okay, so the fuse function as a safety device to protect the wire, the wiring, and the appliances against excessive current flow. So the fuse is slightly higher rating than the magnetic of current which flow in the appliances. So uh, the formula is current equal to power watt divided with voltage. Okay, next one is when uh, the excessive current flow in the circuit, so the fuse will melt and break the circuit. So the earth wire connected to the metal part of the electrical appliances to the earth it carries the leak current from the appliances to earth. Okay, this one is a picture, an example of uh, fuse. Number one is a uh, re uh, replaceable wire fuse, and this one is wire fuse. And this one is a uh, catrice fuse, cannot be replaced. So, one off only, yeah. So the solid cartridge fuse, we have a large, a large cartridge fuse and also glass cartridge fuse. Okay, now we move on to the importance of safety precaution in the use of electrical energy. So the safety precaution of the use of electrical energy, number one is do not overload electrical socket. Number two is replace all wire with worn out insulation with new wires number three do not touch electrical appliances or switch with wet hand and number four do not poke anything into the electrical socket number five 
In case of the electrical fire, switch off the main switch. Use the powder fire extinguisher to put out the fire and also call the fire brigade. Okay, number six is in case of person getting an electrical shock. So step number one is switch off the main switch. Use an insulator such as wood, rubber or plastic to separate person from the source of electrical shock. And never touch the person with your bare hand and give first aid to the victim when we already uh, make sure they are already safe from the electrical shock and also any source of electrical shock there and make sure you send the victim to the hospital.